और केटरफ्लाई के साथ बहुत दिनों से जुड़ी हुई हूँ और इनके साथ काम करती हूँ सिखाती हूँ आप लोग भी जुड़िए अच्छा से अच्छा से पेंटिंग सीखिए पेंटिंग के बारे में आप लोगों को पता होगा मधुबनी पेंटिंग के बारे में जो ये कहाँ से शुरुआत हुआ है कितने तरह का पेंटिंग होता है इसमें कलर कौन सा यूज होता है अभी भी होता है लेकिन हम लोग जो है ना इसमें थोड़ा एक्रेलिक कलर यूज करना पड़ता है क्योंकि नेचुरल कलर उतना नहीं बना पाते हैं उतना नहीं बनता है तो ओके okay. अच्छा और तो हे, हेमा जी जो लोग अभी ज्वाइन किए हैं उनको ये बता दीजिए कि मधुबनी आर्ट एक्चुअली और आप सब जितने लोग ज्वाइन किए हैं कैन यू सेंड इट राइट इट ऑन द चैट इज इट योर फर्स्ट टाइम आप पहली बार बना रहे हैं मधुबनी आर्ट और आप जानते हैं इसके बारे में सो uh, दैट so हम लोग को समझ में आए कि हम कैसे यू you नो know, सेशन को मॉडरेट करें अगर आप चार्ट बॉक्स में डाल सकते हैं तो प्लीज डालिए और उसी के अकॉर्डिंग हम बात करेंगे आगे सेशन को ले जाएंगे वेरी वार्म वेलकम टू ऑल ऑफ यू हु इज ज्वाइनिंग अस ऑन यूट्यूब दिस इज हेमा जी हेमा जी इज आर मधुबनी मिथिला आर्टिस्ट फ्रॉम मधुबनी शी इज विथ अस इन फ्रॉम लास्ट थ्री ईयर्स वी आर डूइंग दीज लाइव वर्कशॉप फ्रॉम मेनी मेनी ईयर्स नाउ एंड we are very excited to welcome all of you uh, for this amazing uh, workshop where uh, we are going to do a kachni style of uh, madhubani art uh, i would take some time now uh, to um, uh, you know explain little bit about madhubani art hema ji ne to bataya hai lekin for as i can see chat mein bahut log likh rahe hain it's their first time uh, so uh, a good understanding of this art before uh, we start uh, the session is always good um to uh, hema ji aapka camera wagera sab set hai main zara sa bata do uh, madhubani ke bare mein aur jitni styles hai madhubani ke uh, ki aur fir hum aage badhte hain theek hai main ek bar bata deti hu so um i want to uh, show you a small presentation and uh, which uh, talks about madhubani art and i will explain everything there um so let's see this um so the screen is visible uh, nidhi about the mithila and madhubani art yes it's visible okay okay so we are talking here uh, about madhubani art ye madhubani art kahan se aata hai iski history kya hai aur uh, Caterfly, which is a company, Caterfly Art and Culture, is our initiative to support and encourage traditional artists of India. And Madhubani is one such art, and uh, we are so so privileged that we are associated with Hema Ji, um, who is not just an amazing artist but uh, an amazing teacher also. So you will know as we go on um, how interesting and uh, knowledgeable this uh, workshop will be. so this is an uh, what is madhubani uh, what is the in, uh, you know uh, many people have uh, heard about madhubani painting or mithila painting madhubani uh, mithila painting or famously now it's called madhubani painting is a style of indian painting uh, majorly practiced in the mithila region of bihar and a joint part of uh, you know terai in nepal so madhubani literally means madhu and bani means forest of honey and these paintings were traditionally done by women uh, who used to do it on the wall and later on it came to cloth and handmade paper and uh, canvases and many more you know they still do it on the wall but uh, the traditional way it started from there um, and the topics of these uh, paintings are like um, you know day to day uh, special occasions like marriage like you know uh, chhat puja holi so every all these topics are covered and beautifully done by these artists uh, uh i don't know how many of you know where is madhubani but madhubani is in the state of bihar um, and many many artists who are from uh, you know ranti or chitwarpur villages are uh, doing solely this uh, uh, work making paintings their entire family is involved in this they are doing from generations so um, that comes from a uh, madhubani is a state in bihar now we talk about uh, so madhubani art is uh, we say in general way that it's a 
Madhubani painting, but it has a very distinct five dif different styles. You know, many most commonly used are bharni, which is bharni is nothing but a Hindi word bharna, filled. Like bharni means filling. And these paintings are very bright. You will see a lot of colors used. You will see very little white space left, you know. So the painting is very, very bright and vibrant and it looks very beautiful. The second one uh, uh, variant is Kachini, which we are going to do in this workshop. This is, uh, in simple terms, it's a line art, mainly used uh, uh, just two colors, many times just black and, uh, you know, uh, otherwise black and red. Um, and all the motifs which are done here is done by line art. So uh, entire space is filled. Uh, making lines uh, or, uh, you know, uh, it's not a not lot of color is used and that's why it has a very distinct um, effect and it's very beautiful, one of the most beautiful uh, styles of Madhubani art. Then we have Godna. Godna is um, not, nothing but now uh, many people know is as a tattoo art. Um, initially, it, it was actually a tattoo um, art only. People used to get this um, on their body. Uh, and uh, this was done with uh, from a very um, selected group of people or cast of people in uh, uh, you know, uh, that district, Madhubani district. Uh, now it is very famous. Now from the body, it has come to the paper and canvas and all. So that they, the same form, how you do the uh, nowadays, modern day, we talk, talk about, we call it uh, tattoos. Um, long back, it was a godna. So it's a it's, it's simple form. It's a piercing, uh, you know, uh, that is the art. And now it's done on the paper. Now the second, uh, these are the th three, and then the next one is Kohbar and Tantric. Now these two are um, uh, majorly um, done for a very specific purpose. Uh, Kohbar is still widely used in Bihar and UP during the marriage ceremony. Uh, Kohbar was a Kohbar ghar or room where you know newlywed couple used to have the uh, the initial when uh, they used to get married to get blessed there was a kohobar which was done on the wall uh, with all the elements of um, uh, you know kohobar uh, painting uh, and a very specific like uh, there had to be uh, shiv parvati's picture there had to be um, you know uh, colors or uh, there, there, there should be a, a peacock so these elements has a very very significant meaning for a newlywed and uh, these were the means to uh, give blessings to them. So it's still, uh, it's a very widely used, uh, uh, you know, ritual in uh, some part of India, especially Bihar and UP. Uh, so Koba now, uh, these artists and a lot of people are doing it on the canvas and uh, uh, paper also. Uh, tantric uh, style is uh, now, uh, it's specific, it's, uh, I can you know describe it as uh, if you want to translate a very uh, religious uh, these mantras and uh, uh, rituals in form of painting. Uh, very few artists do this, and um, it's because you need to understand the meaning of these mantras and shlokas to interpret that onto paper, and that's why uh, very few people do it. Um, and it's not very, uh, you know, a famous style of Madhubani art now. Uh, earlier, few artists used to do, but now it's very selected people use uh, artists do it. Uh, so these are the five uh, different styles of Madhubani art. We are going to do a Kachni style here. Um, now, there are many, many um, amazing artists who have taken this art art form forward and have done tremendous work for uh, uh, people to get to know it and uh, to make it widely accessible to people. And surprisingly, uh, most of these um, artists who are, you know, National Award winner, Padam Shri, uh, all these were women. 
So that's why at the start of this presentation, I said that it's widely done by uh, uh, ladies of the house. Now, a lot of men also do it. But if you see this, uh, you know, Bawa Devi, she got National Award uh, uh, in 1984. Then there's a Kachni style Krishnila where Mahasundri Devi Ji uh, got Padma Shri. Uh, so all these amazing artists, then we have uh, some more. There is a uh, Jagdamba Devi who did, uh, who again got Padam Shri. Um, in fact, we will talk to Hemaji and Hemaji will tell uh, from her family also who all got uh, how many awards later as we go on. Uh, so it's amazing to uh, learn this uh, art form. And here is our artist now, Hema Devi Ji, uh, a national award winning artist, a state awardee, many, many awards, you know, as, uh, and we will share this presentation to all of you so that you can, you know, go through this. It's an amazing um, information here. You should know the art form, the background of art form also before doing the art. And these are some of the paintings which we have done with Hema Ji. Um, so it's a combination of uh, Bharni, Kachni, Godna, there's a lot of these uh, workshops which we do in our uh, um, daily, uh, uh, you know, uh, workshop. And we will talk more about this as we go on. Um, so this was uh, our presentation and hope uh, it was, uh, uh, you know, you got some base of Madhubani art. And now with this, we will start the session. Hema ji, I have told you all about the Pacho form. Was it right? Yes, it was right. It was right. It was right. Okay. So now we start Hema ji. And how do we do it? Let me tell you all about it. I will try to translate everything as we go on uh, for people uh, who are uh, here and would prefer English also. And in Hindi, Hema ji will tell you. So, Hema ji, what paper size you have taken and where will we start? Paper size is 12 by 12 inches. Okay, 12 by 12, correct. This half inch is double line. Okay, okay. So, uh, yes, tell me, Hema ji, sorry. In the painting, we put a border in the painting. We put a little border in the painting. If it's a small painting, it's a small paper, we put a line in the painting, we put a semi-circle on the top, double line. So, it works with the border. There are two reasons for border. One is that the painting looks beautiful to see, the other is that the balance is getting the balance. We have to do how much work we need to do in the painting. Okay, very nice. Uh, so uh, to everyone, Hema ji is using handmade paper. Uh, you get handmade paper in a lot of shop. Mein bhi milta hai. And she is using uh, 12 by 12 inch paper. It's a square paper because this painting is on, um, you know, a squarish um, style. But if you have A4, bhi hai, koi baat nahi, you can do it. Uh, just keep in uh, mind that Hema Ji, how the center of the motif is making it. And if you have empty empty space, hoga, you can fill with other motifs. So we will explain that. Now, Hema Ji is very important to know. Hema Ji is doing directly with the uh, pen. And she uses uh, a very different style, which is like uh, she's using a nib and she's just dipping that nib in the uh, uh, color and that's how she is doing it but uh, sabko, I would request everyone please if it's uh, your first time please start with the sketching please use pencil eraser <laughs> and don't go on directly coloring because it will take, take some time if you want to pencil you want to take a marker pen le le, uh, thin uh, uh, nib wala. Uh, Hema ji is taking normal fountain pen. Now that pen doesn't have any ink inside. She is just dipping the that nib into the uh, into the uh, color. It's already zoom. Uh, please increase the uh, uh, zoom it from your end. And now, uh, as Hema ji explained, she has left half inch. You have to leave half inch from all four sides and make a double line. So Kachni, as uh, we described, Kachni is in line art. Uh, we give a very uh, thin lines, all four sides. You have to make a two lines of border. So this paper is small. We are going to ma uh, make a line border here. 
And uh, this color, what Himaji is using is acrylic color. As we mentioned in the messages also, please use acrylic color. Make, uh, you know, when you are using the acrylic color, mix a little bit of water so that your brush or pen, whatever you are using, uh, it moves uh, freely. There is no measurement. These art forms are freehand art forms. You can understand as it's done by traditional artists, there is um, no measurement needed and it should flow easily. When you measure uh, it, you know, to start, you, if you want, you can measure the, use the scale or something, but it will not give you the same effect. It's a normal fountain pen, Sonia. It's, there's no name to it. You can take out the, you know, rubber part from the behind and just use the nib. But I would again say, emphasize this. This is a bit, um, you can try it out. But for this session, I would say, please use either a pencil or, uh, you know, if you have uh, other markers uh, to use, please use that because this technique will take some time for to master. So, uh, border se to half inch diya hai uh, hema ji 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 uske baad jo dusra jo aap double line bana rahe hain uske beech mein kitna gap hoga 1 mm hoga na oh hum to andaaz hai kis hai na ha 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 aapse naapte to nahi hai thoda sa ki humko chhota sa isme pattern aa jaye ha 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 so just just give a half centimeter i think is fine na uh, Hema ji. Ha, Hema ji? Yeah. Half centimeter beach ka gap hoga? Ha, ho sir. Ha, hoga. Ha, Half ha. centimeter. Ha, ha, ha. Theek hai. So, one inch again, um, everyone, uh, don't um, go by exactly uh, or you don't have to copy exactly what Hema ji is doing. If you want to do a give a if your distance between both the lines is a bit more or less, it's perfectly fine because we are going to make a very small design in between. Okay. So for your reference, from border, we have given half inch uh, and we started double line, then give half um, centimeter of space and then make again double line, all four sides. में जितना डिजाइन डालेंगे बॉर्डर से लेकर अंदर तक सब में लाइन वर्क डालेंगे लाइन करके के डिजाइन डालेंगे ओके सो इस पेंटिंग में जनरली uh, सिर्फ ब्लैक और रेड यूज होता है हेमा जी 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 ब्लैक रेड से यू यूज करेंगे और जितना डिजाइन डालेंगे सब लाइन से करेंगे लाइन देकर ओके okay. So everyone who is joining us now, a very, very warm welcome to all of you. Uh, we are here with uh, our uh, national award winning uh, Madhubani artist, Miss um, Hema Devi. And we are doing a beautiful painting in Kachni style of Madhubani art or Mithila art. Uh, as you see, Hema Ji has uh, used square paper because this uh, painting we are make, going, going to make a circle circular form and uh, that is the main central motive um, and that's the reason we have used this square so that it fills uh, um, you know it's the same from all sides but if you are using a4 size 
um, just follow uh, Himaji's instruction as we go on. And if you have empty space at the bottom or at the top, we will uh, let you know how can you fill it. So uh, the beauty of uh, Madhubani art is that, uh, you know, uh, you can do many things and uh, uh, there's hardly a very, uh, you know, uh, stiff rules. It's not that you have to follow certain things. Yes, you should understand the different styles of Madhubani painting, but there is a lot of scope to add your own um, artistic, uh, you know, uh, ways or you want to add something from your side. Um, this paper is handmade paper. Um, you can... Now it's available on many, many shops. So, um, and always handmade papers are, um, the texture of handmade papers are always very nice. So uh, if you have not used it yet, please, uh, uh, you know, find it in the shop and try uh, some paintings on that. Do put in your... Uh, Questions in the chat box as we go on. We'll try to answer as much as we can. So for everyone who has joined now, uh, we have given half inch of a border um, from the edges and we have started uh, with two lines. Then give approx half centimeter of spacing in between and then again make two lines. So what Hemaji said in the starting, there is a reason why uh, we make uh, Madhubani uh, border in Madhubani painting. Because um, uh, borders are very important part of Madhubani painting. If you'll see many of these, uh, uh, the, as the uh, size of paper uh, increases, more and more uh, layers of uh, borders are done. Um, first of all, it gives a very beautiful and heavy impression. Um, also, uh, it's a way to, uh, you know, understand how much space is left and gives you an idea about uh, how to utilize the space in between. Uh, so Sandhya, you have a handmade paper, please use it where it is bitter. That's how you'll get the grip. Yes, it's amazing to see her working without scale and such as a straight line. Uh, because again, uh, you know, just to mention, she is doing this art form from, you know, maybe uh, more than uh, 30, 35 years. Uh, her entire family is uh, into this art form. So they, uh, they are, uh, you know, uh, doing and breathing and living this art form. Hema ji, aap sabko pata di ji, aapki family se kisko kisko kya kya award mila tha, mein sabko dikha rahi thi ki kitni ladies ne, kitni women ne is uh, art form mein kitna apna yogdaan diya hai. Uh, to aap ek bar dikha di ji, uh, aap ek bar bata di ji. Pahle to mere Ganga Devi jo hai, mere chachi hai, unko padma siri mila, mila tha. Ah, to Ganga Devi, which we showed just now in the presentation, uh, is aunt of uh, Hema ji. Uh, who got uh, Padam Shri. Uske baad mammi ko national award. Aapki mammi ka naam kya hai maji? Leela Devi. Okay, achcha. Uske baad hum do bahan hai, dono bahan ko national award. Wah, wah, kya baat hai. Hmm. Teen bhaiya ko estate award, char bhabhi ko estate award. <laughs> achcha. <laughs> Amazing. Pura <laughs> parwar mein hum log यही काम हाँ. करते हैं यही काम करते हैं पेंटिंग बनाते हैं हां देखिए ये चारों तरफ हो गया हम डबल लाइन करके के कर लिए हैं लाइन खींच लिए हैं अब इसमें हमको डिजाइन डालना है डिजाइन हम कुछ भी डाल सकते हैं तो ये कचनी पेंटिंग है इसमें हम डबल कचनी करेंगे ब्लैक से एक बार पहले नीचे से ऊपर ले जाएंगे लाइन We'll show you a uh, closer also. Let her do a little bit and then I'll ask her to show close to the screen. Theek hai, ek bar le jayenge aise. Ek bar pahle pura hum kar lenge, niche se upar le jayenge, tirchi line mein. Achha, ek bar paas se dikha dije ga Hema ji, ta ki sabko samaj mein aaja. Kitna distance hai lines ke beech mein. 
लाइन के लाइन में लाइन टच नहीं होना चाहिए बस उतना ही जगह रखिए ओके ओके सिंपल स्लांटेड लाइंस एंड दिस इज व्हाट शी सेड कि स्पेसिंग आप बस इतना रखिए यू कीप द स्पेसिंग सो दैट इट डजंट टच विद ईच अदर बट don't give lot of space also otherwise uh, you know it will not look uh, uh, very refined work so give enough space just so that lines are not touched with each other but make it uh, close to close enough सो so, uh, ये जो लाइन है ये हम चारों तरफ ऐसे ही करेंगे हाँ ऐसे ही करेंगे चारों तरफ पहले hmm. पहले एक बार कर लेंगे उसके बाद फिर दोबारा इसी पर चलाएंगे वो हो जाएगा hmm. डबल कचनी हाँ तो हम बस एक साइड का ऐसे बताएंगे हेमा जी नहीं तो बॉर्डर ही बहुत टाइम लेगा ना ठीक है ठीक है हम एक साइड करके छोड़ देते हैं hmm. एक बार आप कलर यहाँ पे ऊपर में रख लीजिए हेमा जी और दिखा दीजिए आप कैसे डिप कर रही हैं थोड़ा आप पेपर के ऊपर रखिएगा क्या या साइड में दिख नहीं रहा है कलर हाँ ठीक है अब दिख रहा है हेमा जी सी इट्स शी हैज मिक्स लिटिल बिट ऑफ वाटर इट्स सो दैट इट मूव्स फ्रीली एंड शी इज जस्ट डिपिंग द निब इन दैट कलर एंड मेकिंग इट it looks very simple but believe me it's not so simple with the nib um because you have to dip it again and again of course uh, she does it uh, with nib only so it's uh, she has a lot of practice but it's a good technique to um, you know master so if you can use it for other time ha hai ma ji jaise hum yahan corner se shuru kiye ha ha ab yahan corner aa gaye ye corner mein hum fir jaise ghuma lenge thoda chhod kar ke isko इधर ठीक स्पेस बचा हुआ है इसमें हम टच कर देंगे ओके परफेक्ट फिर हम और इधर से शुरू करेंगे फिर इस तरफ दूसरे तरफ हाँ जी ठीक है सो आई होप इट्स क्लियर टू एवरीवन हाउ शी हैज डन इट चारों कॉर्नर में इसी बनेगा ठीक है सो इजी वे तो ये भी होगा ना हेमा जी की हम चारों कॉर्नर में पहले ज्वाइन कर ले और उस तरफ से फिर उसी डायरेक्शन में करते रहे चारों कॉर्नर में पहले एक एक लाइन डाल लेंगे करेक्ट है ना या सो या ठीक है फिर अब हम इसको डबल करना है हम्म सबको मैं रिक्वेस्ट करूंगी प्लीज आप फुल स्क्रीन में ये वर्कशॉप देखे एंड अगर आप लैपटॉप से देख सकते हैं तो बेटर है क्योंकि ये बहुत क्लियर है एंड uh, uh, अगर अब आपको ने... शुरू में पहले ऊपर से नीचे लिए हैं लाइन अब हम नीचे से ऊपर ले गए हैं अब हम ऊपर से नीचे लाएंगे तो बेसिकली क्रिस क्रॉस कर रहे हैं है ना क्रॉस क्रॉस हो जाएगा हाँ 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 ठीक है अब इतना को आप दिखा दीजिए पास से ताकि सबको आप पता चल जाए कैसे कर रहे हैं जितना स्पेस दे करके हम पहली बार दिए हैं उतना ही स्पेस डाल करके हम फिर दोबारा दूसरे बार में देंगे ठीक है ठीक है हिमाजी सो दिस इज हाँ इसी को सो दिस इज द वे वी आर गोइंग टू मेक अ बॉर्डर स्लैंड यू नो Uh, lines both sides uh, so you have to basically this is a criss cross uh, make sure that aap jab ek line ke upar dusri line dal rahe hain it has the same uh, gapping as before so it will give you a uniform look
ये कॉर्नर हो गया फिर हम इधर से फिर घुमाएंगे फिर शुरू करेंगे यहाँ से अच्छा ठीक है ओके सो हम पैटर्न तैयार करना है हाँ तो हम अभी एक साइड हमने किया है दिस इज द वे यू हैव टू डू ऑल फोर साइड विल नॉट बी डूइंग ऑल फोर साइड इन द सेशन अदरवाइज इट विल टेक सम टाइम सो आपको सेम पैटर्न यूज करना है हेमा जी एक बार ये बॉर्डर का पास में मैं एक अच्छा सा पिक्चर uh, लेना चाह रही थी आप बॉर्डर को पास में दिखाएंगे क्या एक क्लियर एक मिनट एक जगह रखिएगा हेमा जी बस ठीक है ठीक है मुझे अब हमको ये बॉर्डर भी बन गया ये इसमें बैलेंस भी मिल गया जो हमको क्या बनाना है अब सेंटर पार्ट में एक सर्कल बनाएंगे ठीक है सो सेंटर पार्ट ढूंढने का कोई तरीका मतलब आपको तो एक्सपीरियंस है तो आपको पता है uh, कैसे एग्जैक्ट सेंटर लें या एग्जैक्ट सेंटर होना जरूरी भी है क्या हाँ जरूरी है जरूरी जब तक ये सेंटर पार्ट में नहीं बैठेगा सर्कल तब फिर फिर जितना हम बनाएंगे जितना बैठेगा सब टेढ़ा बन जाएगा जो भी बनाएंगे सब टेढ़ा बन जाएगा तो इसका okay. जो है तरीका तरीका है जो स्केल से आप चार लाइन बीचे बीचे खींच लीजिए okay. बस के चिन्ह बना लीजिए उसमें वो आप बना लीजिए ठीक है से फिर उसको मिटा दीजिए ठीक है ठीक है सो दिस इज व्हाट हेमा जी एक्सप्लेनिंग दैट दिस सर्कल हैज टू बी परफेक्ट इफ यू आर डूइंग एंड आई वुड सजेस्ट एवरीवन टू मेक अ मार्क एट द सेंटर बाय जस्ट यूजिंग द स्केल एंड जस्ट यू नो कितना कितना इंच का होगा ये हेमा जी सर्कल एक बार आप बता सकती हैं क्या हाँ इसका नाप देते हैं हाँ सो विल गिव यू दॉक्स मेजरमेंट ऑफ द सर्कल बट प्लीज मेक फाइंड द सेंटर पॉइंट एंड फ्रॉम देयर मेक दिस एंड आई वुड से इफ यू हैव अ स्मॉल यू कैन ऑल्सो यूज अ डिफरेंट टूल्स लाइक यू नो स्मॉल uh cup size or uh, uh, you know the bowl anything which is uh, you think it's the same measurement you can use it six inch ka hai six inch ka total mm -hmm. ठीक है सो इट्स अ सिक्स इंच नाउ अगेन टेक द मेजरमेंट शुड बी हेमा जी सेंटीमीटर होगा ना सिक्स सेंटीमीटर होगा इंच तो बहुत ज्यादा था हम्म नाउ टेक द मेजरमेंट अकॉर्डिंग टू योर पेपर इफ योर पेपर इज बिग योर सेंट्रल पार्ट इज you know uh, big enough to uh, so the pattern is visible right now hema ji is saying uh, 6 cm because her uh, paper is 12 by 12 inch but aap ye dekhiye ki circle paper ke accordingly kitna kitni jagah le raha hai agar paper bada hai to ye circle hmm. ke upar se line daliye isme bhi hmm. humko border banana hai char line char line dal kar ke जैसे डबल लाइन डाले बीच में स्पेस डाल करके फिर डबल लाइन उसमें भी हम एक पैटर्न डालेंगे तो आपका अगर पेपर बड़ा है तो आप ऊपर से जैसे हम सर्कल बनाए इसके ऊपर से डालिए दो लाइन स्पेस छोड़ करके अगर पेपर छोटा है तो अंदर से स्पेस छोड़ करके अंदर से फिर ले लीजिए वेरी गुड टिप सो वॉट हेमा जी से that if according to your paper size you can do many variations if it's a bigger size then you can make another line outside of the uh, circle which we made right now but if it's a smaller than uh, right now the existing paper then you can make a uh, line inside so this is how we are talking about how you can use the space here but one thing which is uh, noticeable is always uh, most of the time in madhubani art or mithila art 
lines are made in doubles. So it's important. And especially with the, um, you know, this style of art, Kachni, uh, lines are, uh, you know, majorly done in doubles so that it gives you that thick impression. Dekhye, double line, then space, then double line. Kar kar ke, then we have to put it in the hmm. border. We have to put it in the border. We have to put it in the circle. Then we have to put it in a small circle. Okay. We have to put it in a small circle. We have to put it in a circle. Then we have to put it in the space. We have to color it in black. Okay. Then we have to put it in the paper. Then I will explain it to you. So now we are making a pattern in between the main thing. Now she has, she is making circle within those two double lines. Now these circles should touch each other, right? And of course, at the top and the bottom of the circle, you'll have a space uh, which is uh, not touching and that space needs to be filled by black. So this is the pattern you have to do all around of the circle. And uh, Hemaji is, uh, while Hemaji is doing this repeat work, uh, you can also follow her, but I will talk a bit more about uh, why we are doing what we are doing right now. Uh, Caterfly is a travel uh, and experience-based company. Uh, we are uh, headquartered in Switzerland and we also have a office in India. Uh, majorly, we do um, travel and uh, one uh, uh, sector of that, uh, you know, uh, area is art. So there's a lot of art based travel uh, happens where, you know, we take people to uh, places like Madhubani and all where artists like Himaji uh, lives. And along with uh, seeing the places, you also learn the art from these artists. So these are the art-based travel. And uh, and apart from that, we also conduct online workshops with uh, uh, artists like Hemaji uh, on daily basis from Monday to Thursday or Friday, depending on the themes. Uh, Nidhi will talk more about uh, uh, these and give you more information about this. Uh, so Madhubani is one art form. Uh, we have uh, same way. We work with... Uh, only traditional and native artists of India because we believe that, you know, and that's why we started this, this initiative that um, uh, we need to support them and encourage them and to bring them forward uh, and to, uh, you know, give them the platform to reach out to many people as they can. So uh, Caterfly Art and Culture Initiative is uh, uh, a path towards that only. Um, so we are having uh, these workshops. We try to uh, help them to sell their products and all. And also um, we have other art forms uh, where we work with um, native uh, artists uh, like Patta Chitra, Pichwai, Kela Mural, Varli, Kaligat, uh, Mesur uh, painting, miniature. There are a lot of these art forms and all these art forms are conducted by these traditional native artists. So we'll uh, give you more information about these things as we go on. Uh, abhi Hema ji, abhi kya karna hai? Iske aage aap half circle ka design de rhi hai. Iske upar, iske upar semi circle dalenge, double line se. Thik hai. So, see, Madhubani art form is a very decorative art. Uh, you can do so many things and you can even modify according to your choice. Right now, Hema ji is giving like a, you know, broad that uh, half uh, circle design outside of the circle. Uh, but you now the one thing which, uh, you know, uh, you are, uh, you have to notice that the motifs used here or the designs pattern used here uh, are, uh, if we are making a circle, then most of these things will be in circle, you know, the pattern which we are making. We will uh, zoom it. We will show you uh, closer to the screen. Uh, let the artist uh, complete that uh, section so that, you know, we don't disturb her. And uh, it's a simple half circle, you know. This is, she's just putting it above the line, but we will show you. Just, just give us a time. Hey, Maji, camera thoda niche ho sakta hai kya? Yeah. 
और देखते हैं हुआ क्या हाँ अच्छा हुआ? एक बार पे, पेपर को ऊपर करके दिखा दीजिए सबको आई वुड अगेन रिक्वेस्ट एवरी वन टू सी दिस वर्कशॉप इन फुल स्क्रीन प्लीज ओके हिमा जी परफेक्ट थैंक यू I'm also sending it in a WhatsApp group so that you have a, uh, you know, reference to if you are doing it right now. Otherwise, anyways, we will share the recording and pictures after the session in the classroom as discussed. Okay. So now, uh, अभी हम एक फिश का शेप बना रहे हैं ना हिमा जी हाँ फिस का शेप बना रहे हैं अभी अभी पहले हम फिस का शेप बना लेते हैं उसके बाद इसको में डबल लाइन डालेंगे फिर इसका ऊपर नीचे का जैसे फिस का चेहरा कहाँ से है कहाँ से हम बनाएंगे इसका पीछे टेल कहाँ तक बनाएंगे ये सब हम बाद में डालेंगे पहले इसका हम शेप तैयार कर लेते हैं तो अप्रोक्स uh, मेजरमेंट बताइएगा क्या मतलब कितनी लंबाई है फिश की ताकि सबको समझ में आए एंड ऑल्सो हेमा जी जरा सबको बताइए कि फिश जो है वो मधुबनी पेंटिंग में इतना यूज क्यों होता है इसको हम लोग को मिथिला में ना मछली को गुडलक मानता है अच्छा शुभ मानता है इसलिए हम लोग पहले मछली को ज्यादा तैयारी करते हैं ज्यादा बनाते हैं मछली फिश बनाते हैं ज्यादा क्योंकि ये शुभ होता है इसका शादी ब्याह हो या कोई शुभ काम करने जाता है तो या मछली देख करके जाता है या मछली खा करके जाता है हम लोग को शादी में जब बेटी का विदाई होता है तो वो मछली खिला करके ही मम्मी उसको विदा करती है अच्छा ओह वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग सो फिश इज यू नो कंसिडर्ड वेरी ऑस्पिशियस इन मिथिला रीजन Uh, like what Hema Ji was explaining right now, that most of the uh, important occasions are, uh, you know, the fish is a important part of it. So even in wedding and all, uh, you know, bride and groom they are, uh, uh, you know, they eat fish for good luck or if uh, some something, uh, uh, you know, new has to start. Uh, in typically they make fish, uh, so. one of the and on painting also you'll see lot of madhubani painting uh, with these uh, fish as a main motive so since this painting is uh, you know uh, the central part of this uh, painting the main motive is fish this is what we are doing it right now uh, like fish there you will see lot of peacocks also used in madhubani painting uh, so these are uh, important motives of uh, mithila art सो so, इसकी लंबाई आप अप्रोक्स ये समझ लीजिए कि सर्कल से यू आर स्टार्टिंग एंड यू हैव टू यू नो लीव वेरी लिटिल स्पेस अराउंड द बॉर्डर सो यू हैव टू बेसिकली कम क्लोज टू द बॉर्डर इसका जितना पार्ट है सब हमको बोल्ड करना है इस ब्रश से Um, हेमा जी अगर किसी को मतलब इस देखिए आप तो ऐसे आप uh, आप एक्सपर्ट हैं तो आपको पता है कितनी जगह छोड़नी चाहिए कोई और ऐसा तरीका कि ये सब एक जैसा बने इसका जो तरीका है जो सर्कल में आप गोल लगा लीजिए पेंसिल से सर्कल ये जो ये पेपर जो है ना हाँ उसमें जैसे हमको ये ये पार्ट ये चारों तरफ जो है स्पेस इसमें तो टच भी हो जाएगा तो कोई दिक्कत नहीं लेकिन कॉर्नर में तो टच नहीं होगा 
पर्सनल में टेस्ट टच होगा तो फिर टेढ़ा हो जाएगा तो इसके अंदाज से एक बार सर्कल बना लीजिए पेंसिल से ताकि हमको उतना ही दूर में अंदर में लेना है ओके 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 सो यू नो इफ यू वांट टू मेक इट वेरी परफेक्ट बट अगेन इट्स अ फ्री ढाई इंच फिर सेंटीमीटर में आप बता रही है ना हाँ इस सेंटीमीटर में हम बता रहे हैं साढ़े नौ सेंटीमीटर का ये है अच्छा सो नाइन एंड हाफ ओके 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 सो एंड टू एंड इट्स नाइन एंड हाफ सेंटीमीटर लेंथ बट अगेन इट विल वेरी फॉर योर पेपर टू पेपर वन टिप विच हेमा जी गेव इज दैट फॉर यू नो यू कैन मेक अ सर्कल विथ फुल विथ ऑफ द पेपर विच योर सर्कल शुड टच द एजेस ऑफ द बॉर्डर so that you know where the tail should end but uh, if even if it becomes little bit big and small don't worry there is always a way to uh, you know beautify it jaise aap dekh sakte hai hema ji ka bhi beech mein thodi si jagah bach gayi hai but she will do something to cover that it will not even you know uska cover ho jayega ye jab bold karenge na cover ho jayega ha ha theek hai so first of all make the shape um all around and uh, she is just making it uh, you know just making it dark so she is using again she is put um, using the line to make it dark you have to make these edges uh dark enough if you have a broad uh, marker then you can use it for the edges right now or if you have a thin marker you can just give a double line to that सो अभी ये सेम चीज चारों तरफ करेंगे हेमा जी डबल करेंगे सब सब फिश को सब को सब को ठीक है नाउ शी इज ज्वाइनिंग द टेल एंड नाउ यू विल सी दैट एक दूसरे के टेल में इसका ज्वाइंट करेंगे ये दोनों अच्छा अच्छा सो इट गिव्स यू इफ यू सी दिस she is joining the tail and uh, if you see from this angle it's uh, uh, it looks like a heart uh, in center or a leaf shape so try to make these uh, you know these uh, forms um, at a equidistant so that it gives you a beautiful pattern uh, if your video is stuck wani please join again because it's working fine from this angle i hope uh, everyone is able to see it clearly please let us know so the same way you have to join it uh, all the fishes and it will give you that uh, pattern uh, and this is a good time nidhi to uh, you know um, to talk about uh, what's coming next what do you have there for everyone uh yes yeah, sure thank you pragakshi um likewise we were just talking about uh, the workshops which we conduct uh, for different art forms so they are conducted regularly and uh, here in a bigger group we have to keep the participants on mute so that the artist work is not disturbed but in those uh, regular sessions which we conduct daily uh the participants are free to speak to the artist they can uh, speak for any query if they have they can show their work and they can uh, like uh, interact with the artist and many more things happen when you are interacting with the artist so definitely um those workshops are uh, like uh, very uh, uh, like they are in a very uh, detailed form the we move step by step 
and uh, we also talk a lot about the art and the painting and all so uh, because we are uh, like um, we just explain everything about madhubani so i would just want to show you the calendar which we have for the upcoming madhubani workshop so like we are doing this free workshop uh, we want to showcase the artist work likewise we want you all to join the uh, paid regular workshop as well because that's the way how we support these native artists and we also try to preserve this art so and uh, obviously you get to learn a lot in those um, regular uh, workshops so meanwhile um, uh, hema ji is doing the same repetitive work she's just double lining all the uh, fish motif i will take you quickly through the uh, calendar of uh, madhubani calendar so just give me a minute i'll share my screen and here comes the madhubani calendar so i will share the link of this in some time so as you can see this is the madhubani live workshop calendar july to november so uh, we at cadefly basically give the visibility for the next 3 uh, months next quarter so that you know what is coming up and which workshops you are interested so that you can schedule and you can uh, like uh, know uh, for which workshop you can take out time and which you can join so as you can see the first one which is starting from 4th of september on the occasion of uh, Gan ganesh chaturthi we have chosen this workshop ganpati ji in madhubani painting so like we were just telling about the different styles of painting this is a bharni style so we it's like uh, made in bharni uh, painting and if you can see below this all the other details are mentioned like the dates the time the duration and the price and material needed is also there below this so if anyone is interested to join this workshop can register because there is a registration link also below this uh below this after this one we have this nari shakti I, as you can see this is a very typical design and a very different modern type of uh, madhubani in which we will start from 18 september and uh, it will be till 22nd november it's one week workshop so as you can see it's a different kind of madhubani painting then we have this harmony in nature this is again bharni uh, style but uh, it has all the main motives of madhubani like fish uh, peacock as you can see and it's done in a typical madhubani uh, style so this will start from the last week of september and obviously all dates price and everything is mentioned below this and the material also then we have this very uh, exclusive workshop mahishasur mardini which we will start on uh, 9th of october on the occasion of um, uh, like uh, uh, navratri we are doing this and uh, this is, as you can see different forms of mata uh, ji is there and um, uh, it's a three, it's a, like a detailed workshop so we will be doing it from 9th to 20th october it will just complete on the time of durga puja after this we have bird and lotus it's a simple workshop like uh, basically design specially for beginners but or anyone can join so it's a short form it's a short workshop of 3 hours so only for 3 days it will be there then we have this ayodhya vapasi on the occasion of just before uh, diwali we are doing this uh, as you can see it's a bharni style of painting uh, and a bit of kachni is also done in this then we have this mayur nritya uh, similarly uh, simple design after this we have the harmony of enchantment and it is like krishna with cows it's also a very different type of madhubani painting which has bharni and kachni mix so this is the calendar which we have made for the upcoming 3 months and because you are doing the workshop with hema devi so this is the right time to register for any workshop of your choice and uh, as a part of this um, introduction we are, we, we are offering 20% off if you register for any of these workshops so if you register any workshop within these two days of uh, the class when it is going on you can uh, get avail flat 20% off on the price so uh, you can contact me my i have been interacting in the group since uh, the first day so you can contact me and you can let me know if you want to register for any to any of the workshop this uh, offer is open only for two days so now let's continue i will just share the link in the group as well so let me know so lion we are back and you've done a bit of oh design okay uh, hema ji jo aapne wo design uh, ek banaya hai fish pe uh, mm -hmm. wo ek baar aap dusre fish pe bhi bana dijiye taki 
ये ये यहाँ से यहाँ तक तो पूरा हम स्प्री बना लिए है ना तो इसको हमको कहा से इसका चेहरा है वो हम बनाएंगे जो फेस कहाँ से है फेस ओके okay. यहाँ से हम लाइन डालेंगे डबल लाइन डालेंगे फिर स्पेस छोड़ करके फिर डबल लाइन डालेंगे इसमें भी okay. हमको कोई एक डिजाइन बॉर्डर डालना है पैटर्न डालेंगे ये okay. गले का डिजाइन हो गया इसका फिर इसका ये गले का डिजाइन यहाँ ये आंख हो गया यहाँ ये उसका मुंह हो गया ओके okay. अब इसके इसमें हम जितना डिजाइन डालेंगे वो अच्छा ही लगेगा प्रिंटिंग अच्छा लगेगा हाँ जी यहाँ से यहाँ से हम इसका स्पेस डाल लिए हैं कि यहाँ से इसका पीछे यहाँ पीछे टेल है हम्म वो डिजाइन हम यहाँ डालेंगे गले के पास उसका वो डिजाइन हम यहाँ टेल के पास भी डालेंगे ठीक है सिमेट्री बनाने के लिए ताकि एक जैसा लगे एक जैसा लगे देखने में सुंदर लगेगा जैसे हम ये इसका फेस के लिए हम गले का डिजाइन डाले हैं या लाइन डाले हैं अब चारों तरफ जब हम एक ही रंग से डालेंगे एक ही साइज में तो देखने में सुंदर लगेगा पेंटिंग अब एक को ऊपर डालेंगे एक को नीचे डालेंगे तो अच्छा नहीं लगेगा हाँ जी ठीक है सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट पॉइंट हियर वॉट हेमा जी हैज मैं जस्ट नाउ जब आप डिजाइन बना रहे हैं तो ट्राई की सब हर फिश का डिजाइन एक जगह हो यू नो लाइक इफ फिश का जो सर का पार्ट है द हेड पार्ट दैट शुड बी द सेम साइज फॉर एवरी फिश सो डोंट डू अप एंड डाउन अदरवाइज इट विल नॉट लुक सिमेट्रिकल एंड इफ यू हैव सीन द रेफरेंस इमेज विच वॉज हिमा जी इज वर्क ओनली इट लुक्स सो ब्यूटिफुल बिकॉज देर इज लॉट ऑफ सिमेट्री इन इट सो दैट्स वॉट हेमा जी इज डूइंग आप हर फिश का जो डिजाइन बना रहे हैं वो सेम होगा बट उसका जो लेंथ है सेम होगा ना हेमा जी या डिफरेंट डिफरेंट डिजाइन सेम होगा सेम होगा अगर आप ये डिजाइन चेंज कर सकते हैं तो ये दो दो लाइन जो है जैसे डबल लाइन स्पेस डबल लाइन ये तो सब में आएगा चारों तरफ लेकिन इसका जो उसके बाद वाला डिजाइन है आप डिजाइन चेंज कर सकते हैं जैसे एक में हम ये स्पायरल वाला डिजाइन डाल दिए हैं एक में हम ये सीधा डिजाइन डालेंगे ओके ठीक है लेकिन ये लाइन बराबर होगा सेमी सर्कल बराबर होगा ठीक है ठीक है सो टिल यू नो दैट आईज पार्ट प्लीज मेक द दो सेमी सर्कल अराउंड इट 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 इज इम्पोर्टेंट टू डू इट फॉर ऑल आफ्टर दैट यू कैन चेंज द डिजाइन बट अगेन हेमा जी जो दो डिजाइन है वो ऑल्टरनेट uh, होगा एक के बाद एक राइट जी जी तो इसके बाद वाला जो फिश होगा उसमें आप फिर पहला वाला पैटर्न डालिएगा ये वाला पहला वाला करेक्ट करेक्ट सो यू हैव टू फाइंड द सिमेट्री यू नो इफ यू आर यूजिंग टू डिजाइन यू कैन आल्सो यूज वन डिजाइन फॉर ऑल द फिशेस आई मीन दैट विल आल्सो लुक वेरी ब्यूटीफुल बट फॉर द यू नो प्रेजेंटेशन पर्पज वी हैव शोड यू दैट यू कैन डू अ डिफरेंट डिजाइन ऑल्सो इसका बॉडी के डिजाइन भी डाल से चेंज कर सकते हैं ओके okay. एक में अगर पसंद है तो आप सेम डालिए सब में नहीं तो आप चेंज भी कर सकते हैं अल्टरनेट भी डाल सकते हैं ओके okay. जैसे हम ये तिरछी लाइन में डाल दिए अब हम इसको फिर तिरछी लाइन में कचनी कर देंगे ओके okay, पास से दिखाइएगा हेमा जी करने के बाद ताकि सबको समझ में आए एक छोड़ करके एक तरफ हम कर लेते हैं हाँ जी सो सिंस इट्स लाइन आर्ट वी आर डूइंग डिफरेंट पैटर्न्स विथ लाइंस um as you can see hema ji has made slanted lines and now she is just joining two lines with the uh, small lines filling it basically instead of filling with the color she is make filling it with the lines okay as you see the एक, pattern is khali hai ek khali hai ek mein hum dal diye hain ab paper ghuma kar ke fir hum is taraf se dalenge जो देखने में भी टाइप का लगेगा 
बीच में जो दिखेगा ओके ओके देखिए ओके ये डिजाइन डाल सकते हैं अगर पसंद है आपका तो इजी लग रहा है तो सारा में एक डिजाइन डालिए या फिर चेंज करके अल्टरनेट डालिए होप इट्स क्लियर टू एवरीवन so you can choose in any of this design or you can do the both designs um, in alternate uh, fishes uh, whatever you feel uh, is uh, you like or it's easier for you ye design ab itna par bhi chhod sakte hain nahi to aur isme aur design daliyega dekhne ke liye sundar lagne ke liye थोड़ा थोड़ा इसमें एक कॉर्नर जो बन गया है डिजाइन डालना और कलर डालना अपना अपना तरीका से डालिएगा और सुंदर लगेगा जो आपको पसंद आ जाए देखिए ठीक है सो so, बस एक सर्कल लेके इसको नीचे किया है ना हेमा जी आ, अभी जो दूसरे वाली फिश में जो पैटर्न आपने बनाया है उसको बस एक सर्कल टाइप का सेमी सर्कल जो डालते हैं ना उसको थोड़ा ऊपर उठा करके जैसे अब इसमें हम जब दो डिजाइन डाले हैं तो पूरा पेपर में दो डिजाइन डालेंगे इसके इसके बाद तो फिर ये डिजाइन डालेंगे हाँ जी फिर इसके बाद ये वाला डालेंगे हाँ जी सो it's a same pattern everyone so just now she'll again do the same pattern so please have a note now if you have missed earlier alternate karke you have to make a pattern now she is doing the uh, the second fish uh, detailing in the this one right now because you have to do alternate fishes with the same design
Ha, ya. देखिए ये इतना जो हम किए ना आप इस पर से हमको ये सेमी सर्कल डालेंगे थोड़ा सा ऊपर उठा उठा एक लाइन हम डाल दिए दूसरे लाइन हम ये कॉर्नर बन गया है ये कॉर्नर में डालेंगे अब सबको हम कॉर्नर में ही डालते चलेंगे पता चल रहा है जी जी हेमा जी सॉरी मैं म्यूट पे थी हाँ सही है होप इट्स क्लियर टू एवरीवन नाउ कॉर्नर बनते जा रहा है ना सब कॉर्नर को हम ढकेंगे ये गोल गोल करेंगे बीच हाँ हाँ समझ आ गया समझ आ गया हेमा जी ये जो नॉर्मल जो एक्चुअल फिश का जो पैटर्न होता है वो यही बन रहा है अभी देखिए हाँ हेमा जी परफेक्ट थैंक यू अब कलर पेंटिंग अगर हम बना इसका फेस जो पूरा है ना ये, येलो से हम भर देते हैं हम्म कलर पेंटिंग हम बना दे तो इसका हम फेस पूरा येलो करते हैं लेकिन अच्छा। हमको कलर नहीं बनाना है हमको ब्लैक एंड व्हाइट बनाना है तो उसका हम डॉट डॉट डालेंगे पूरा अच्छा डॉट से इसका तो, फेस कर देंगे नहीं नहीं तो हम अगर रेड यूज करना चाहें तो रेड से भी कर सकते हैं ना हिमा जी नहीं तो रेड पूरा अच्छा नहीं लगेगा ना रेड बहुत अच्छा। कम डालता है बहुत कम तो रेड से आप स्टार कहीं कहीं डाल दीजिए कहीं कहीं हम्म हम्म ओके ओके बट इस पेंटिंग के लिए हम सिर्फ ब्लैक यूज करेंगे रेड से कहीं कहीं स्टार डाल दीजिए और उसके बाद आप डॉट डाल दीजिए ब्लैक से तो वो अच्छा लगेगा तो so, पूरा जो फेस का जो एरिया है वी हैव टू फिल्ड विथ डॉट्स विल शो यू हाउ इट लुक्स वंस हिमा जी इज डन आई रिक्वेस्ट हर टू शो जैसे ये पेंटिंग में हम रेड का काम करेंगे तो इसका मुंह जो बनाए हैं मौत उसमें हाँ, रेड डालेंगे हाँ, ये गले के पास जो डिजाइन बनाए हैं उसमें हम रेड डालेंगे ठीक है आप ये और डिजाइन जो इसमें बढ़ाएंगे तो इसमें रेड डालेंगे अच्छा अच्छा ठीक है तो ये जो डॉट वाला है वो कैसा दिख रहा है पास से दिखा दीजिए थोड़ा थोड़ा और नीचे है मुझे क्लियर नहीं है ओके 
उतना क्लियर तो नहीं दिख रहा है बट सिर्फ डॉट डाला ना आपने हम्म हम्म डॉट डाला ठीक है सो जस्ट फिल दैट स्पेस विथ डॉट डॉट दैट सेट it's uh, there is no specific design so it's fine if it's not very clear also the thing is that please note how she is joining and making the lines at the same place now if you see that uh, she is making this fish um and the portion of the you know face the double line is exactly same as other fishes that's what you have to take care these dots and all even if it's not perfect it will not make uh, much of difference but the symmetrical uh, feel to uh, of this painting will come uh, with the exact how you place the you know uh, the half circle of the neck where whether you are putting the tail uh, double line at the same place uh, for all the fishes or not सो so, uh, हेमा जी आज uh, आज की डेट में ज्यादा भरनी का काम होता है या कचनी पे होता है ज्यादा भरनी पे होता है अच्छा और उसका कारण क्यों है क्योंकि वो कचनी पर में होता है लेकिन कचनी में होता है ना कि सारा पेपर तैयार करना है कचनी से उसमें मेहनत बहुत ज्यादा है बहुत ज्यादा है करेक्ट एंड भरनी का काम तो बहुत जल्दी हो जाता है एक बार आप जब सारा वो, वो फिगर बना लीजिए फिर कलर ही फिल होता है ना हम्म उसमें मोटा काम होता है ना भरनी में मोटा काम होता है लेकिन कचनी में मोटा काम नहीं होता है जी जी उसको तो so this... पतला से पतला एकदम छोटा से छोटा डिजाइन डालिए द मोर फाइन वर्क यू डू इन कचनी एंड दट हेमा जी इज एक्सप्लेनिंग दैट मेजरली भरनी स्टाइल ऑफ मधुबनी पेंटिंग इज वेरी फेमस which is with a uh, you know bright colors and all because it's much easier to do and it takes less time because it's a thick work but this form of style the kachini which we are doing today in this workshop today and tomorrow it's a very fine work it takes time you have to really do everything with just lines and that's why not uh, you know just do uh, the reason that uh, it takes more time um, it's not as popularly uh, used as bharni style but uh, it's a, it's a very beautiful uh, style of madhubani art
ये इतना डिजाइन होमवर्क में रह जाएगा कि बनेगा पर कल इसी पर अभी अगर इसके बाद हिमा जी अभी तो टाइम है आधा घंटा टाइम है ना हाँ 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 तो अभी अगर पैटर्न रिपीट पैटर्न है तो दे सकते हैं लेकिन अभी फिर और क्या करेंगे मतलब कुछ ऐसा हाँ 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 साढ़े चार बजे बजने वाला ना हाँ करेक्ट तो ये पैटर्न जब फिश का पैटर्न हम बना देंगे तो उसके बाद कल क्या क्या करेंगे ये बता दीजिए ताकि सब उतना तैयारी करके आए इसका तेल का काम होगा बीज का काम होगा रेड का काम होगा ओके सो और सेंटर सर्कल का बीज का काम होगा ओके ठीक है और सो uh, so कल के लिए रेड कलर का अगर एवरीवन यू हैव रेड कलर पेन मार्कर पेन और रेड कलर प्लीज कीप दैट रेडी बिकॉज विल यूज रेड कलर टुमारो फॉर द डिटेलिंग सो बेसिकली वॉट यू हैव टू सो आज इतना ज्वाइन कर लेते हैं हेमा जी जो आप अभी कर रहे हैं और फिर जो रिपीट काम है जो फिश पे ये कल सब कोई करके आएंगे है ना सर्कल का डिजाइन बनेगा उसके बाद रेड का काम होगा ठीक है ठीक है ओके सो फॉर टूमोरो वी हैव डन फोर फिशेज टूडे टू शो द a uh, different pattern and how you have to alternate the design the same way you have to do it on each of the fish uh, of course if you are making one design only then it will be same design for all the fishes but if you are uh, altering uh, it please make sure that it's one by one and just follow the design we will anyways update the classroom with the uh, the pictures and today's video so that you can refer to it while making it and uh, uh, recording वगैरह हम सब share करेंगे that was the reason why निधि was asking everyone to join the classroom we will again share um, the classroom link uh, in the group and uh, you can access that निधि uh, what are you, what is there you want to show uh, you want to show something now uh, before we you know wrap up the session and everyone can you know have a look at yeah. what's coming next sure so likewise we uh, i'll just show how uh, the you can access the recording through the uh, uh, link but before that i would just quickly take you through the another uh, like uh, workshop details which uh, like uh, the art form which we do which is kali ghat and uh, if uh, many of you must be knowing but let me tell you kali ghat is a art which is from west bengal region and it is basically practiced uh, the our artist who teaches us he is a net, native artist from mednipur uh, district so uh, it is also called uh, like uh, patachitra of uh, like uh, 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 bengal bengal so i will just show you what we have planned so uh, there's a typical form which uh, a style which kali ghat paintings you will see so let me show you what comes up uh, in kali ghat specially so you'll have an idea and uh, as i told you the app, the offer is applicable on all, on all the upcoming kali ghat work workshops as well so like you see the shiva family on the occasion of shravan purnima we are doing and we are starting it from this coming monday uh, from 28th august as you can see and kali ghat timings are 1 to 215 uh, monday to thursday or monday to friday depends upon the um, what like the uh, workshop which we are doing the complexity so uh, as you can see after this we have this nauka vihar in kali ghat as you can see this is a beautiful painting and we will be doing it from 4th september to 14th september then we have this lord ganpati on the occasion of ganesh chaturthi so all the details about the workshop details about the paintings are mentioned and listed below each um, theme so you can see the date the theme the time duration and price and also the material list then we have this beautiful couple in kalighat style which is a typical babu bibi style in kalighat which is practiced and which is made in the kalighat workshops then we have this goddess durga in kalighat on the occasion of durga puja 
and uh, so uh, this is before durga puja and we will be doing one more after this we have this bhagwan ram and sita in vanvas by jamini roy style who is a very famous artist in kaligarh uh, santal um, art form then we have this ma durga on occasion of navratri i could, as you can see this is a very uh, different and uh, typical like a uh, different style of uh, painting it's some little modern uh, style then we will be doing this jalpari in kaligarh so all these workshops which i have just shown you uh, they all are applicable for 20% off and this is the reason i wanted to show you so if you are interested and if you want to register for any of these workshop this is the best time because you can avail 20% flat off on these and this is valid only for two days today and tomorrow so if you register within the two days then only you will get the discount so let me know i'll share the details in the group as well so this is what i wanted to show regarding kaligarh rest we'll speak tomorrow uh, just to take you through the classroom the link which i am providing you on the whatsapp group is through that you can access the uh, through that you can access the um, uh, recordings of the class today so once you uh, like uh, click on that link you will enter to a page like this you can see madhubani master class with caterpillar and a page like this will appear in which uh, a message from uh, my side is there so uh, if you are uh, seeing it through a mobile at the bottom you will see these tabs and if you are seeing it from a laptop at the top you will see stream classwork people in grade now if you click on classwork you will reach to the all the themes which uh, like we have done in the past so uh, below this madhubani art and the artist we'll just add this 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 session complimentary session by hema ji and um, we'll just, you'll find it below this madhubani art and the artist after some time so uh, you just need to click on like i'll just show you uh, for example i'll just show you one like a tree of life tree of life in black and red so you will find four tabs under that like theme and description pictures videos and submit your work so pictures if you click you will find the pictures of today's session videos if you click so pictures will be like this step by step then videos uh, for video you will get if you click you will find the video under that and then very important submit your progress uh, submit your final work so here whatever you have done today and if you want the feedback on that i would request everyone to submit your work under this tab only and not share your work in the group because it will uh, you might miss some important message coming from our end so if you want feedback on your work please submit your work under this tab only and uh, likewise we'll be able to give you the feedback so this is how the classroom work i will just share the link in some time and you can all join the classroom and from there you can access the recordings Okay, wonderful. Thanks, Nidhi. Uh, so Nidhi just explained how can you access recording and pictures later on. Uh, we'll share the link once again when classroom is updated uh, with today's picture and video. Uh, so Hema ji has also, uh, you know, just joined all the fishes uh, tail and made that form. So kal ke, kal aane se pehle, uh, we would request everyone if you can finish this pattern, make these uh, fishes and make the pattern as a uh, uh, taught by Hema ji and then so that we can uh, you know start from uh, tomorrow for other part of the painting uh, Hema ji itna ho gaya na aaj ke liye ho gaya aaj ke thik hai to sab log ye pura bana ke aayenge sare fishes and fir hum wahan se aage badhenge hai na Okay, thank you very much. Hope all of you have enjoyed the session, um, learned something new and got a good, uh, you know, understanding of Mithila art. Um, we would be uh, happy to see you again tomorrow. And uh, with this, uh, we will just take a leave and bye-bye uh, um, uh, from now. Hema ji, dhanyawad. Thank you very much. Welcome. Bye. Bye-bye. Thanks, everyone. Thanks for thank joining. You. We will open this session tomorrow for some time at the end so that you can uh, show your work to Hema ji or ask any, any uh, questions you may have. So please join uh, tomorrow uh, and we will um, start the session again and you can, uh, you know, uh, 